Operation Cold Case. The Nassau County Sheriff's Office recently released a video showing a person who may be connected with the disappearance of a local woman more than 20 years ago. News for Jack's reporter Alicia Hatcher sat down with the Cold Case Unit to see how the video, Alicia, can hopefully answer some questions. It's been almost 22 years since 51-year-old Jacqueline Markham disappeared from Callahan. The Nassau County Sheriff's Office says they're only releasing the video now because it was overlooked during the, the original investigation. This is a video recently released by the Nassau County Sheriff's Office. Take a close look. Detectives are asking for your help identifying this person in a black jacket, burgundy scarf, and blue jeans. The sheriff's office believes getting in touch with him could help with the cold case disappearance investigation of Jacqueline Markham. When we looked at the video, the video was of a white male with very red hair. Rose says this man went to the Little Champ convenience store on Lim Turner Road and the Sprint store in Callahan. He looked at the flyer of Jackie Markham, walked up to the clerk's desk, the convenience store, and told her that you need to search the woods behind Jackie Markham's house. Markham was last seen on December 14, 2000 at the Eckert's Pharmacy in Callahan. It's almost the 22nd anniversary of her disappearance, and NCSO hopes to find Markham and give her family some type of closure. We do not believe that this is our suspect. We just believe that this individual may have information or he may just be someone who's just stating the obvious that that's where we need to look. Several people have been interviewed over the years, but no one has been charged and Markham's body has never been found. The Nassau County Sheriff's Office is asking anyone who may know anything about the disappearance of Jacqueline Markham or can identify the person in the video to call the Nassau County Sheriff's Office. Kent Joy.